Hi there, this is Marius, and today I want to show you two cool things on the Mac. And the first thing I want to show you is what you see right here. This is a, a game called Trackmania Nations Forever. Uh, the best thing about it is it's free, but on the downside, uh, it's only for Windows. So what I want to show you is uh, I'm running this using Crossover Games, which is based on Wine. And uh, I've tried getting this game running in Wine a few times, it doesn't work. So here it is in Crossover Games, which I actually got for free. Uh, it was it was available for free recently, for, for one day. Or a little bit longer than that, actually. And uh, I'd just like to show you, it runs really smoothly. Everything runs really nicely. Uh, so here I'm running in a window, you can also run it full screen, of course. I'm just going to pick a race here, I'll probably pick this one. And uh, let's just wait for it to load. And you'll see the graphics are really nice, it's really smooth. I don't know how smooth it will be on the video, but uh, it's definitely a very, very smooth frame right here. I, I'm running on an iMac, uh, 2 gigahertz, And it is lacking some of the effects uh, from the Windows version, but overall I think it looks really nice. So I'm just gonna run through this race here to give you guys an idea. Turn down the volume a little. Alright. Oh, and there I go. And that was that. Anyway, as you see, I pretty much suck. So I'm just going to stop this right here. Anyway, so if you enjoy playing games like this, I can really recommend it. It's a lot of fun. Uh, you can play online against other people and things like that. You can get it, it's from Nadio, and it's called Track Mania Nations Forever. Again, you might have more luck uh, than I did with Wine, you can try it with Wine, but uh, it definitely works on crossover games. So that's the first thing I wanted to show you. Now the second thing uh, I want to show you is um, how I actually captured this game. And I'm using a little app called uh, Screen Camera, which is by myself and I will release it shortly, probably in a few weeks and the best thing about it is it's free of charge I'm just going to show you a little bit how this works basically what uh, what screen camera does is emulate a virtual camera which films any portion of the screen you like so the screen camera interface allows you to specify any portion of the screen using this window here uh, which will then be recorded uh, this interface here is just preliminary, it won't look like this in the final version, but uh, you can just, you know, you get the idea of how it will work. And uh, then what you can do is just launch iMovie, this is what I did, just launch iMovie, and then you can select the camera from the uh, camera sources, and you will get whatever is displaying inside of your camera window. So, look out for that, it'll be released soon, I'm not sure of the name yet, maybe screen camera, maybe something similar. Uh, and I'll let you know once it's released. Thanks for listening and watching.